Greetings. This is a planetary alignment and earthquake watch for the time periods of April 14th through April 22nd, 2016. Significant planetary alignments will be taking place during this watch. The Venus-Uranus conjunction taking place on April 22nd and the important Venus-Sun-Jupiter alignment taking place on April 14 should ensure volatile periods and if possible foreshadowing or one or two earthquakes registered over 7 magnitude during this watch. We're now looking at the April ephemeris. We have very strong celestial interactions taking place with not only Venus and Jupiter being aligned from the 14th and 15th of April, but the potent interactions of Uranus should ensure high volatility and the potential for very powerful earthquakes here on the Earth during this watch. It is worth noting that the Mars influence will also be highly significant for the month of April, as Mars will be stationed and also moving direct on April 17 during this watch. The following day, April 18, Pluto will also be moving in retrograde motion. Now the importance of the Mars retrograde this time around is that it is occurring near the Mars-Saturn conjunction and this in the past has caused a considerable amount of volcanic activity to be occurring as well simultaneously. So this period between April 14 through 22nd will not only produce high solar activity towards the beginning but also the possibility of volcanic activations and volcanic eruptions taking place during this watch as well. As well as important planetary alignments taking place during this watch there are some strong astronomical events taking place in April that need to be mentioned as well. Uranus will be in conjunction with the Sun on April 9, but during this watch we have the Moon-Jupiter conjunction taking place on the 18th. On the same day Mercury will reach its greatest elongation. And capping off this watch period, on April 21st the Moon will also reach apogee. We now look at the very important lunar influences that will be in play during this watch, as the month of April is a supermoon where the Moon will make its second nearest approach to the Earth for the entire year. The periods between April 17 through 21st are highly significant as we have the Moon-Jupiter conjunction coinciding with the Moon-Neptune opposition and on the 21st we have a simultaneous interaction and opposition between Venus and also Uranus taking place with the Moon. I do follow the Moon-Jupiter conjunction very closely. We see three earthquakes registered over 7 magnitude occurring within a 36 hour window of this conjunction and during the month of April the Moon-Jupiter conjunction will take place on April 18 during this watch. And finally wrapping up the lunar influence we need to look at the lunar perigee and apogee information as the lunar perigee is a supermoon which has a strong profile for the Central and South Americas. But the important lunar apogee taking place during this watch has a strong profile over the Philippine plate and this is the moon's overhead or longitudinal position at the time of the event. Looking at the important planetary alignments we note that five alignments are taking place, four of them involving Venus. As well as the geocentric alignments mentioned earlier, we have heliocentric influences on the 14th which are important. Venus Sun Jupiter will take place simultaneously as Mercury Venus Neptune will take place on the same day or just three hours later. As mentioned the Mars retrograde takes place on the 17th of April. Now this is significant as it does have a strong history with strong earthquakes here on the Earth as well. The last two retrograde cycles of Mars saw two earthquakes registered to 6.5 and 6.4 earthquakes and these were registered in the south of Fiji Islands and also the Ryukyu Islands region. If we go back further we see a very powerful earthquake magnitude 8.3 struck in Hokkaido, Japan. This was on September 25, 2003. We may see strong solar activity begin on April 14 and 15. This is due to strong planetary geometry involving not only Venus and Jupiter in their opposition heliocentrically but also we have Uranus and the Earth at a near opposition which should kickstart the Sun into strong solar activity. We're now going to plot some areas on the Earth that could be the recipient of strong earthquakes during this watch. This is due to recurring harmonic symmetry of planetary alignments. We see that the San Juan Argentina region could receive a very strong earthquake due to the Earth Venus Uranus alignment, the same alignment that occurred on November 23, 1977, which produced a 7.4 magnitude earthquake. My second area of concern will be for the Sea of Okhotsk. Now there were two earthquakes registered at 7.7 .7 magnitude in 2008 and 2012 with similar planetary geometry and also surrounding regions of Sakhalin, Russia and Kuril Islands. This will be the second area of concern during this watch. My third area of concern will be for southern Italy as the strong symmetry with past earthquakes and the Venus-Sun-Jupiter alignment stand out. This will be the third area of concern. And the fourth and final area of concern will be for Western Asia, specifically targeting the Kyrgyzstan. Tajikistan and surrounding regions for a potential 7 magnitude earthquake. 
I do expect one or two areas could receive strong events during this watch. It's definitely a time period we all need to watch and monitor, especially culminating into the Venus-Uranus conjunction on April 22nd. And that concludes this planetary alignment and earthquake watch for the 14th through 22nd of April 2016. For more information, please visit solarwatcher.net where there will be more content for members and subscribers as well as a website newsletter. Annotations and results of this watch will be added at the end of this video. Thanks for watching.